foster care is improving in the natural state according to new data, but there's still a lot of work to be done. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Jennifer Pignate. KNWA's Inkerika Azuka spoke with a woman who grew up in foster care about how 15 years in the system impacted her. She joins us now live in studio with that story in Kirika. Well, Jennifer, a new study shows more kids are being placed in family home settings over group settings, which advocates say is a positive thing. But older and minority children are still having trouble getting placed into homes. My parents were pretty heavily involved in drugs. They actually cooked meth. Ariel Fox was almost six years old when she was put in the foster care system. She lived in both family and group home settings until she aged out at 21. Group home had cameras in every room. We weren't allowed. Like, it was just not a... I would just take home out of that. New data by the Annie E. Casey Foundation states from 2007 to 2017, Arkansas placed more kids in family home placements over group settings like shelters or group homes. Those kids end up um, not having as good outcomes as kids who have connections to family. The study also shows kids over 13 and minority kids are more likely to end up in group settings, which Laura Kellums with the Arkansas Advocates for Children and Families says is a national trend. We don't have enough foster families um, at, at, as a nation or in Arkansas in general. So one thing we need to do is recruit more families. A mission the nonprofit organization The Call has dedicated itself to by training and supporting potential foster parents. We're specifically wanting families who understand um, that they're going to be saying yes to um, some hard placements, some hard behaviors that they're going to bring in. Can you just Help me with Coordinator Ann Mythaller has fostered dozens of kids over the years and even adopted six of them. She says while family settings are usually preferred, it's not for everyone. If their pain and their hurt that they're walking through comes from a family setting, putting them right back into a family setting can be triggery. Today, Fox is a 25-year-old wife and mother. She says family settings worked better for her and encourages families to consider fostering. Don't let like that fear of you being heartbroken keep you from loving a child who may not know love otherwise. Now, the call has opened over 500 homes for kids in Northwest Arkansas. For information on how you can get involved, visit our website, nwahomepage.com. Live in studio, in Kirikazuka, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.